Hi, I'm Andy Gillian. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. This guy's one successful motherfucker. And for the most part, you'd be right. Sure, I get the ladies. You know, my last Instagram post got about 15 likes. <laughs> but the thing is, I'm not talking about the women or the fame. I'm talking about money. And let me tell you something. I don't have any. I've released six albums worldwide, toured the globe, and my music has almost 20 million streams on Spotify alone. So why then am I still eating out of bins? Oh yes. Oh shit. Did it Now you may be sick of seeing all these GoFundMe and Kickstarter campaigns from artists begging for more money so they can go on and do bigger and better things. But the reality is, I'm not looking for extra cash so I can dump a load of explosions in my vlogs. And I'm not going to piss the money up the wall by recording at a needlessly expensive recording studio. Can we cut the music? It's, no one's going to take this serious. It's supposed to be a serious ad. This, no one's going to take it serious with that 80s shit in the background. Put something dramatic on. No, less dramatic. Okay, somewhere between the two. Okay. I just want to continue making music and video content and do more of it and not have to give it up because I was too afraid to ask for the support of people who like what I'm doing. I'm not going to get rich from doing this, but maybe with your help, I can continue to do this for as long as people are interested. I want to make more music for you. I want to make more vlogs and stupid videos like this one. But even stupid videos like this take a shitload of time to write, film and edit. What's going on here then? What are you doing? I'm trying to film a Patreon video. Just thought I'd play a bit of Streets of Rage. So. No, fuck off. But no one wants to pay for anything, I don't either. Paying for stuff is the worst. It's your money and you worked hard to get it. But the problem is we're so used to receiving music for free these days that it's lost all perceived value. When actually writing and recording an album can take several years of time and effort. Get fucked mate, music is just a hobby. It's not a real job. The reality is some of your favorite musicians probably work other jobs to get by. People need to forget how successful they think their favorite artists are and start getting angry about what the industry has become. I firmly believe that the future of the music industry is in the hands of the fans. It's time to start taking ownership of where your money is going and start supporting the indie artists. Thank you for watching and if you like what I do, I invite you to support me on Patreon so I can do more. Cheers.